Hello, everybody. So this is Drew Thomas here. Drew Thomas Friends Season 2 will be coming up this year. However, it's about time I discuss with you what I'm going to do and what I'm not going to do for Drew Thomas and Friends. So, yeah, mainly what I'm not going to do. So here it goes. Here's one thing I'm never going to do on Drew Thomas and Friends. I am. I don't think I'll put in any learning segments. I mean, I could easily do a learning segment, but well, that will just give more time and more you know, episodes, I have to make more episodes. And, you know, I cannot put two episodes together because well, it'll just be it'll make the video too long, it'll take up storage. And yeah, I mean, you guys can put episodes together on your own version of a Drew Tom's Friends DVD and make like a custom, you know, intermission screen. But yeah, I am never repeat never going to put learning segments on Drew Thomas and Friends. Most people hated the learning segments of Thomas and Friends. So yeah, People would just skip them and it'll just take up time. But yeah, another thing I'm never going to do when Drew Thomas is use racism. I'm not going to mention, I'm not going to say the N word, not going to mention certain racist groups like, you know, Nazis, KKK and other stuff. So yeah, there'll be no racist groups or, you know, racist jokes on Drew Thomas. It's just going to be, you know, I mean, the closest thing I've done to a racist joke was on Thompson, the missing feature presentation text was that I had Percy scream to Dora, boo Dora, go back to Mexico. But that was a joke, and it, yeah, it's just a character, and I was being heartless on it, but yeah. It, it was just a joke, but however, 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 you see, I will still have some inappropriate jokes, like, you know, sexual jokes, drug references, and yeah. But there's going to be no racism. And I... And while um, I don't think I'll put any, put any major swear words on Drew Thomas because while lots of families watch my channel and there's actually a family that have, that have a younger kid and this family is a good friend of my family. So yeah, they have a younger kid and I don't want to do that to them. So yeah, and this family in question, I'm not going to mention the names because well, that'll be giving away privacy. That'll be violating COPPA. Um, this family watches, watches my movie like at least like five times ever since I released it. Like, you know, in fact, I'm pretty sure this friend of mine is watching the Thomas Express 2 right now, probably because he said he would watch it with his girlfriend. But yeah, anyway, so another thing I I am going to do is that I will put in new characters and maybe and maybe after the episode that they were premiered in, I'm going to introduce the characters and explain about their show. And I'm like, and I'm going to explain about, you know, the role in the show and you know what they do like maybe for the season two premiere i'm gonna do like a you know healer introduction episode i'm gonna do a healer introduction segment where you know i introduce the healer family and i'm also gonna change the you know end screen to say you know um more excitement coming up soon so yeah wish me luck on that and yeah might i also add that well you know gonna be um you know i think that i'm going to edit um the music videos on kind master and i'll edit the rest of the episode on drew tom on power director so though so there may be two watermarks but actually i'm just going to stick with kind master i mean for the music videos on kind master it's still you know glitches out and you know it still has all this stuff, but while well, Kindmaster will actually load up the restored media if I restore from Google Photos, while Power Director won't load them up, and it'll just show a question mark on a film strip. So yeah. So do not expect any learning segments on Drew Thomas and Friends. Besides, it's not really a kid show. It's a uh, you know, it's a um, older kid, young adult, and you know, um, grown up show. Mainly so I can make Thomas appeal into those who claim it's a baby show. So that way they'll be like, ooh, that content is bad. I'm surprised Thomas did that. However, I'm still bringing the charm of the Railway series, how, how it should be. And, you know, I try not to have the characters bounce around. Uh, oh, wait, I don't try, actually. I have the characters bounce around, but they're not going to use wheels as arms and legs. That's going to be... There's, they're, they're still going to be drivers and firemen, and they're still going to be conductors and railway staff. But, yeah, this is not going to be like all engines go in Chuggington where the human characters are present, but the engines can jump on the wheels and, you know, easily use couplings or buffers or wheels as their arms and legs. So, yeah. Might I also add that, well, you know, Thomas will return to Six Flags and the St. Louis Zoo next year. So, yeah. Because, well, they'll still be Show Me Trains. 
plus, um, I think that I might just, you know, plus I, I was thinking of maybe making the show me trains like a segment on Drew Thomas where it's a show me trains episode and a Drew Thomas and friends episode. But yeah, I don't think I'll do that. Instead, it's just going to be Drew Thomas and friends and the show me trains will be part of the universe and they're going to be referred to as the, the show me train. So yeah. And, and might I also have that I might visit new railroads and yeah. Another thing that I'm going to be doing on Drew Tom's Friends is that, you know, I'll put in more characters, hopefully, like, you know, maybe some characters from South Park, maybe some more Simpsons characters like Krusty the Clown, Lenny, uh, Officer Chief, w Chief Wiggum, Flanders, and all, all that other stuff. And I might include some more Bluey characters like, you know, um, like, like maybe Wendy because of the Hello Wendy gag. And... And also in the family pack, I got the healer family in. Also came with, you know, their other family members. But yeah. Plus, I'm not going to make a lot of these videos because they take up space on um, Google Photos. And I need space to record the next episodes of Drew Thompson Friends. I'm actually going to be recording the next episode tomorrow. So yeah. Be on the lookout for sneak peeks. But there won't really be any sneak peeks. This is going to be my New Year's special, which I think that I'm going to, you know premiere the season two intro in it and i'm also going to premiere you know um the new drew thomas credits and actually there's no good there's not gonna be new drew thomas credits but i i think that instead of a drew thomas music video at the end it's, it's gonna be the drew thomas rewind where you know Tom, where thomas and percy think about all the things they did and the music videos that we listen to and then you know the countdown goes off and then you know uh, while people are celebrating say happy new year the credits roll as, you know, we hear the engine roll call playing as the credits are rolling. And then we see all the logos at the end. And yeah. And then right after the new year, right as soon as the new year begins, I'll begin work on season two, which I'll work on the season two intro and the season two credits and the season two roll call. The question is, should I use a revamped roll call like the, you know, the season 19 roll call or should I just keep the roll call how it is? And no, I'm not going to put in the season 23 roll call with where it says yellow and green, red, orange, and blue. Because one, I don't really have any orange characters. Two, Nia and Rebecca are not in this universe. Also, um, also, I, also, for those of you who don't know about Drew Thompson, friends, it takes place during today. Like, it takes place on what's happening today. Although, you know, the times are different for them at, instead of for you guys. So, yeah. It takes place in 2021. And yeah, well, that's pretty much all to say about Drew Thomas. No learning segments, no racism, but there will be new characters coming soon and a whole lot more fun. And there won't be major swear words either. So yeah, you family members don't have to worry. However, you know, I'll still say major swear words on these videos. So yeah, don't be a little bitch, you motherfucker. Anyway, I'm sorry. <laughs> anyway, so subscribe to Drew Thomas and click the bell to be notified when we upload a new video. This is Drew Thomas here, signing off. Good night and pickle suck. Why do I say this catchphrase? It's because I hate pickles. Good night, everybody.